New details are emerging about an alleged group sexual assault from 2003 involving players from Canada's World Junior Hockey Team. A man who says he saw a recording of an alleged incident is now speaking out to CBC. The story he tells is graphic, and we want to warn you that what he says is disturbing. Ashley Burke reports. <laughs> After winning silver at the 2003 World Juniors, almost every player on Team Canada went pro. But now a source says Halifax police have the names of at least two members of this team who may have been involved in an alleged group sexual assault. When I spoke to the police, I gave them a, a best description of everything I remembered. CBC News is concealing this man's identity. He says he saw a video nearly 20 years ago of the alleged incident and recently gave Halifax police the names of two Canadian players. I recognized two of the players and uh, both of them went on to have NHL careers. He says the details of that video still makes his skin crawl. I seen uh, a hockey player of the 2003 World Junior team, a Canadian player, take a video camera and turn it towards himself and say this is gonna be a fucking lamb roast. A slang term for group sex involving several men and one woman. The man said the cameraman and another player then entered the hotel room. There was five or six naked players all masturbating with one person having sex with a girl on a bed who seemed extremely intoxicated. It made me sick to my stomach. Why didn't you report it back then to police? All I knew for myself back then was that it was wrong, but I didn't know these types of things got reported to the police. He says he spoke up this summer after similar allegations surfaced involving members of Canada's 2018 World Junior Team. Because this still was eating me up inside. What happened to that tape? I have no idea. I mean, a uh, camcorder from 20 years ago, I imagine that it's not, not, not here anymore. Halifax police launched an investigation in July after TSN first reported details of the video. It's one of three separate police investigations in Canada into three different alleged group sexual assaults involving junior hockey players between 2003 to 2018. If the claims are true, experts say it shows a pattern. A form of male bonding ritual that is about the abuse of women, and that is extremely, extremely disturbing. Police won't say if a victim's come forward, but are encouraging anyone with information to contact them. Meanwhile, five players have publicly addressed the allegations, most of them denying any involvement, and Hockey Canada says it's hired an investigator. Ashley Burke, CBC News, Ottawa.